Never. Someone was singing. Yeah, don't worry about it. You interrupted them. Yeah, spoilers. Wow. Hi. Hurtful. Hello. We're here. We are here. <clears throat> and you know what it's time for? It's time for Zelda. <laughs> I thought you were going to say it and then you drank. How's it, how's it going, Tara and Coco? It's great to see you both. Hope you're good doing. Can I drink with Hope you're glass? doing well. <laughs> Hit my glasses. Mm hmm. Do your eyelashes ever hit your glasses? No. Really? Not that I'm aware of. Cause you, got, you got kind of long ones, so I wondered if they were like... <laughs> all the time. I've never seen my eyelashes do that. Okay. Or make that sound. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you're good, do good doing well. Good doing. <laughs> That's what I said out of excitement. Yep. It's great to see you both. Hope you're having a great day. Yeah, thanks for being here. Yes, thank you. How come... When you checked our, oh, never mind. <laughs> I was like, how come when we set up the stream and I looked in the camera, you could read the letters underneath here, but now you can't. Because you lowered Because I chair. lowered my seat. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> I thought maybe. What it, a silly Billy. I thought maybe it cropped us or something. No, no, no. Okay. Are you, do you want to jump in? Yeah. Is there any more ado that we should further? What? You know, without further ado, <laughs> saying, was there any ado that we should further? Oh, I did want to make an announcement because you probably won't be able to see it on the screen. I brought my amiibos. You, shall we show them? Yeah. Well, he's disappearing a little bit, but we got Link. Skyward, we got, the Skyward We got Skyward Link. Link. We also have a, a, some familiar friends. Wolf Link and Midna. We also got, and then... this one's beautiful. Wow. 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 <laughs> the Lachlan amiibo. 
this one's beautiful. I think this is a gorgeous amiibo. So we're going to see how they work with this game. I have never played Skyward Sword, so please no spoilers. Um, I, 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 well, I stand corrected. I started Skyward Sword when it first came out, and then I never continued. So. Also, I'm eating dinner, so I apologize for crunches. Okay. Ready? Yes. It's time. This is my Switch. That's why it looks a little different. Because Tori doesn't have these games. I, well, I have Animal Crossing. There's a lag. There always is. Yeah, but there's a lag there. There always is. No. Yes, there's like a one and a half second delay because of the Elgato. It takes time for it to encode and send it to my laptop. It's literally been that way since I've started streaming. Oh, okay. That's going to be very loud echoing into... I, I want to be able to hear You'll it. You'll hear it. It's just very loud. Hi, Riddy. Thank you for the host. That no, didn't, spam that the didn't chat. Make any sound. I know because all my alert sounds are broken and I haven't had any time to fix them. So of Not all of them, but I some of them. So Hi, Spartan. Thank you for the host. To you. Spoiler. Your it has a lot of hate, friend, but it's one of my favorites, Ryan. Coco said. Oh, should I? Um, I haven't decided if I... I have my Pro Controller, but I don't know if I should play with this, with the, the Joy-Con or not. Up to you. Thank you for shouting out, Terror. How are you doing today, Riddy? Do you want me to read it? Yeah. This is a tale that you humans have passed down through uncounted generations. It tells of a war of unmatched scale and ferocity, the likes of which would never be seen again. But it will. Thank you for the reset. Every Zelda game has. One dark, fateful day, the earth cracked wide, and malevolent forces rushed forth from the fissure. Fissure. There's no breaks. Yeah, I gotta fix it. They mounted a brutal assault upon the surface people, driving the land into deep despair. Driving? Driving. <laughs> they burnt forest to ash, choked the land's sweet springs, and murdered without hesitation. Who did this? Did they say? I think so. Distracted by the gray square. Hyped for Friday? What's Friday? They did all this in their lust to take the ultimate power protected by her grace, the goddess. Oh, Pokemon. I ain't getting Arceus on release. I'll wait a few months. <clears throat> The power she guarded was without equal. Echo, turn on the bedside lamp. Handed down by gods of old, this power gave its holder the means to make any desire a reality. Such was the might of the ultimate power that the old ones placed it in the care of the goddess. To prevent this great power from falling into the hands of the evil swarming the lands, the goddess gathered the surviving humans on an outcropping of earth. She sent it skyward, beyond the reach of the demonic hordes, beyond even the clouds. Did she? She did. In fact. With the humans safe, the goddess joined forces with the land dwellers and fought the evil forces, sealing them away. At last, peace was restored to the surface. This is a tale that you humans have told for many ages, generation to generation. But there are other legends, long hidden away from memory, that are intertwined with this tale. Now a new legend bound to this great story stands ready to be revealed. A legend that will be forged by your own hand. You're a good reader. Thank you. Thank you. That's probably why those are my most popular YouTube videos. I'm going to tilt this just a bit. Which should help with that square. Oh, See? look. Look at that. That's film school. That money went <laughs> to a great cause. Fortunately, it wasn't a lot of money. True. 
Okay, let's hang on. We got st- the chat exploded as soon as I was trying to focus on that. So hang on. Okay, we'll catch up. <clears throat> Thank you for 13 months of subscribing, Spartan. That's incredible. Thank you so much. Hello, Riddy. Oh, it's starting this oh, no. again. <laughs> Okay, hold on. Okay. Ultimate power of snacks. Beautiful. Thank you for the bits. Um, you have it pre-ordered, Coco? That's exciting. I hope you guys enjoy it. I'm sure I'll pick it up at some point. I just am not going to do that on release because I'm still playing through Brilliant Diamond. Thank you so much for 46 months of subbing, Paige. That's incredible. Isn't someone's birthday coming up? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Mm-hmm. Mine. <laughs> Two weeks from today. <laughs> um, Angels? I mean, that is also true. Angels' birthday is pretty close to mine. Thank you for shouting out Paige. Oh, no worries. I just... You didn't interrupt the intro because I didn't actually read your comment <laughs> until after. Disappointed to have heard Arceus is already being pirated. People are the worst. Hey, Storm. Thank you for good reading hype. Uh, thank you so much for your song. Thank you for shouting out Storm. Thank you for the bits. I think Shout this out is, to Flight of the Concord. I yeah. think this is proof that Zelda is the fan favorite games to play. People come in when we're playing Zelda. Yeah. People are like, we gotta get, we gotta get there right now. <laughs> yeah. Which I'm <laughs> glad because I love Zelda games. Yeah. Thank you for, sh- hi Puffy and thank you for shouting out Puffy. Wow, there's just so much happening. Okay, awesome. And we're in, and we're in a level one hype train right now. What does that Guys, mean? Th- when people like subscribe or use bits or whatever, it like builds like a hype train. Oh. Um, well, I should see if I can do my little sub thing because it should be around my sub anniversary. Spartan says he likes seeing us get frustrated from time to time. <laughs> yeah, see? Oh. Whoops. Shut you up. Can hit show down there. We're just hearing ourselves back. The people love Zelders, I suppose. It's true. S K W Y W A R D S K. Squyward scored. There. She didn't even say it. She just spelled it. Yeah. What a lame-o. Stupid. Just because I put it in all caps. Level one complete. Yay. I think I want, I kind of want to just make the character name Link. Sure. If that's okay. That doesn't bother me. I, I know we normally make a Hallorby com- or something. Yeah, yeah, make a combination of I'm our names. I'm still waiting for I Love Horses 2 TBH. I, y'all, it's funny you say that because when we were at the uh, secondhand give, uh, gift store, game store the a uh, couple weeks ago, uh-huh. um, Holland spotted... Or may, did I spot it? I found it okay. and insisted. She insisted I insisted buy. Insisted emphatically. A, a wee horse game that I bought. Yep. And I had to explain to the man who was checking out, who was, you know, ringing me out, that this was for stream and not because I actually wanted this. And then he followed me. <laughs> yep. Then he proceeded to follow Tori on Twitch. So you're welcome. And no. you're welcome. So that'll happen at okay. some point. <laughs> yes way. Ooh. Fancy. <laughs> On the true MVP as always. That's yeah, it's, me. it's gonna be a fun time. Ooh. It looks like... I didn't realize the whole story. I feel like it looks like a Pokemon. Kinda. When we see more of that thing, I'm gonna tell you my favorite thing about that thing. But I'll wait till we get there. Oh, okay. Squyward scored. (laughs) (laughs) The best game. Oh, we're level three hype train. Mm-hmm. 
The le. Whoops, I leave that there either. <laughs> the le. Yes, technically Skyward Sword is the first game in the series. If you're going chronological, if this is this takes place earliest with in the, the timeline. Hyrule histori according yeah. to the official Hyrule historian. This one happens first in the universe. We should show the people are that no the no the no the the amiibo that one. For those who didn't see it earlier, look at this gorgeous amiibo. I brought my amiibos. From now on, I will call every Zelda game the le. The le. They did a great job with uh, high defining this game. <laughs> No, the no, the no, the remix. <laughs> Remember in Twilight Princess when he has the little dream sequence and everybody's falling upside down? Mm -hmm. That's great. Rise, Link. The time has come for you to awaken. Says who? You are fated to have a hand in a great destiny, and it will soon find you. The time has come for you to awaken. Link! Well, good morning to you, too! It would be cool to live on Skyloft. Wow, okay. Glad to know birds can just open doors here. They're smart. They are smart. Birds are very smart. Hey, sleepyhead. I know how much you like to sleep in, so I'm guessing this letter will be your alarm clock this morning. Did I guess right? Rise and shine, Link. Today's the wing ceremony. You promised to meet me before it starts. Remember? You better not keep me waiting, Zelda. <laughs> you received a level two hype train emote. We unlocked an emote. Link didn't promise, he just went, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> No, he probably went... <clears throat> I really love the character designs for Link and Zelda in this game. Did you just hear my Link impression? No. He probably went... <clears throat> <laughs> That's good. Wow, look at those... Wow, this <laughs> game is so intuitive. Doing... Sit stand. I'm doing my workout. Why can't Chair I read squats? this... Why can't I read this book? I guess it's not important. Ugh. I want to read these books. Turns out this whole game is just sitting and reading. Why can't I not Link, move the camera? Link, um, study with Link. <laughs> and it's like, that would be actually kind of a cute game. Like, study with Link, and it teaches you, like, basic math and phonics or something. <gasps> well, I'm not. Control mode. Button only controls. No, we don't want to. Mm. You can't change that unless you're playing with just a. Uh, oh, I see. Use motion controls. Hi, Zyber. Oh gosh. Use motion controls for aiming. Camera speed. Yeah, Zelda music is top tier. What's this? Simple, normal. I think that means all the stuff that appears. You can simplify it, and it'll get rid of some of your like floating stuff, like your hearts and things like that. Hmm. Look, I have a rupee bag. Mm -hmm. That's all I have to my a name. A small wallet. Ooh, collection. Okay, be safe, Spartan. Nice. How do I get out of this dang room? I can't the see because I can't move the camera. You can't? No. Oh. Hold O now. Hold L and tilt R. Hmm. 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 I don't 
don't know if I like this. Starting off positive. Who are you? Morning, Link! <laughs> I have my mouth full of food. You're gonna have to read him. <laughs> Why does he have that voice? Because my mouth is full it's of food. It's like a little child voice. That's like the... It's like Mallow and Tallow's voice from Twilight Princess. Okay. Either you read him or let me chew. I'll let you chew. Okay. He's oh. like a grown adult. He needs like an adult voice. I mean, he could still have an annoying voice because he looks kind of like a tool bag. <laughs> but, and his name is Pippet. Just wait till you meet some of the other guys here. <laughs> his name is Pippet, which is not a good, not a good first impression. So, today's the wing ceremony. Are you ready? Is that better? Yeah, it's good. All I'm saying is, everyone else is out practicing at the plaza, but you seem pretty uh, relaxed about the whole thing. Of course, that crimson loft wing of yours is something special. I feel pretty confident riding him too. My bird won the last ceremony, but even I don't think he could beat that red terror of yours. Of course, a bird's true speed in a race always comes down to the skill of the rider. Tough day for all the pivots out there. <laughs> Pippet now has to have food and mouth voice. Oh, one moment. Rip my fellow pivots. <laughs> I'm something of a bird researcher around here, wow, so you know, okay. if you ever find yourself in need of some bird expertise, come see old Pippet. I like his little. <laughs> like is he wearing chainmail? He is. Yeah. Hey, Link. The day of the wing ceremony is finally upon us. How tall are you? Very. <laughs> <laughs> it's time to put what you learn to use. All those practical skills I taught you and all the academic prowess instructor Horrell taught, Horwell taught you. While we're at it, do you remember how to look around using these buttons? <laughs> Press these buttons when you want to take a look at your surroundings. Mm. I feel like a, this is high key for here. <laughs> Guess I'll never need bird expertise. I just think all of the environments in this game are so lovely. Got my fancy footwork going on. Wee, 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 wee. Juke them out, juke them out. <laughs> so you basically live in like a boarding school. And these are all the rooms. Oh, that's my room. Yeah. Go back out. Never mind. Don't talk to anybody for a minute. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you okay there, buddy? Can I pick this up? Yes. Yo. Throw it. Throw it. I can't. I can only pick it up and put it down. Oh, no. Okay, you can talk to him. Hey. Good morning, Link. Today's the big wing ceremony, right? I wanted to fly too, but I I, I didn't make the cut, so I'm, I'm stuck back here at the academy. Plus, I gotta move these barrels over to the kitchen. I was hoping to at least be able to cheer you on, Link, but I guess that's the way it goes. Go out there and wow him, buddy! Okay. So you're a loser because you didn't make it into the ceremony. I'm sorry for gushing about this game, but like the colors uh -huh. are just beautiful. Who are you? Where in the clouds is that fledge boy? He's supposed to be bringing me barrels. Sometimes I just don't know what's going on in that boy's head. He's a weenie. That's where he's at. Restroom? You know, makes sense. I don't think I've ever seen a bathroom in The Legend of Zelda. But well, here, here we go. are. Sit. <laughs> <laughs> and then it flushes. It's like an Animal Crossing. What kind of a maniac would just go smashing pots? Isn't this a cool town? Yeah, pretty neat. This little goddess statue. 
they're in Breath of the Wild. But they're small. Hey! Hey, Link, up here! Oh, this is, that's the other guy. Yo. Good! Oh, I need to give him another voice. <clears throat> they can have the same voice. Maybe Good morning to you, Maybe they're twins. Yeah. They kind of look like... Today is finally the day of the long-awaited wing ceremony. Are you feeling ready? Oh, I just remembered there's something I'd like to ask you about. Target me and we can have a quick, quick chat. Excellent. Always remember you can target someone to talk to them easily. And even when there isn't anything to target, it's a convenient way to quickly face your view forward. Oh, but it's a little silly to carry on a conversation from this distance. Won't you come join me up here? You should be able to climb up if you dash up to the top of that wooden box, don't you think? Then you can make that jump fairly easily. Try climbing up here. While moving, hold B. To dash. <laughs> You can do your target Five. thing, and it'll switch your view. Save. Oh! So this is how you save, it's the bird says. Save. Wink. So, what are you up to? Rushing to get some last minute bird riding practice in this morning, Link? Actually, I have a date with my girlfriend. Oh? You have someone to meet. Ah, Zelda's waiting for you, is she? Perfect timing, then. You see, Zelda's father, Headmaster Gaypora, has a pet named Mia. And, well, she scampered off again. What? Your first quest. Look! Over there, do you see her? The headmaster is so busy working with Zelda preparing for the ceremony. I thought that maybe I should feed her, but the ceremony's about to start, and I just put on a fresh set of clothes, and well, you see. Will you help me out and go retrieve Mia for me? I am busy. I'm literally about to be in the ceremony? Hmm. Fantastic, so you'll do it. I know you're in a hurry, so I really appreciate you all taking the time to help. Hmm. You should be able to climb up somewhere over there. If you hang off the ledge there, you can climb onto the roof from the other side. I'm terribly sorry, but I know you're quite the climber. I do really appreciate it. <laughs> you're familiar with stamina wheels. Yes. Okay. This was the first iteration of that, I believe. Yeah, you kind of can climb walls on this one. Hello. What Come with me. Are you? It's like a Momo. Kind of. It's like a weird cat. Raccoon bat. I don't know. It's got like big mouse ears. And like a raccoon tail. Who even knows? Look how happy I am holding it, though. Link probably thinks it's cute. Well, I don't know about that. Where are you taking it? To the- oh. I thought that was the guy. No, there he is. This guy. Nice work! You've brought her back safe and sound. Sorry for troubling you with this. I know you're busy, Link. I suppose I should feed Mia now. Please, tell the headmaster that we found his pet. He should be up by the statue of the goddess. Yeah, I... while he's giving Co special tutoring to his daughter. That sounds like nepotism to me. Coco said she double-checked, and it's a remlet. It's called a remlet. remlet. Don't water it after midnight. What's this? Oh. 
if you're running out of stamina, you can run into those and it'll re punch them. That was called steroids. Morning, Link! How's life? Did you manage to get you a week of sleep last night? Figure you might have been tossing and turning all night. Think about the big ceremony today. What might do it? Oh, I'm just fixing this guy right here. I, I should. I could make it even more slurry. <laughs> it's been a quickie lately. Can't have that on death, huh, Moni? You haven't forgot to say the to God this morning, have you? Just face the bus session over there. Say it was all price to save your progress. As you know, it's bus session. <laughs> <laughs> Those bird statues, all of us got. I didn't know he was gonna talk this much. Skylar, this bird statue is gonna have a stop by every statue every time you run by one. Prime time, <laughs> save knives, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I thought he was just gonna say like two lines and we were gonna be done. What if you're just like, save and quit? I'm good. <laughs> that was a fun That's game. That's enough for today. That was a fun game. <laughs> Why do I try talking to this guy? I never understand him. I really don't like how I have to hold down L to change the camera. Yeah. Yeah. I really don't like that. I wish there was a way I could change that. No. Oh. Yo. You doing some exploring? Yeah. Skyloft is so cool. How does one have an accent when they all lived on the same Skyland? I don't know. Yeah, I keep I keep using the camera, the to change the camera, and I realize then I realize it doesn't work. Then I have to hold down L. Come on, Link! Don't be a weenie. Between Link and Nancy, no one's possessions are safe. True. Snuck up behind him. <clears throat> oh, magically teleported over there. I'm not gonna try to sing this. Oh, youth guided by the servant of the goddess, unite earth and sky, bring light to the land. Hey, good morning, Link. I'm glad to see my loft wing got you out of bed. I was pretty sure you'd sleep in and forget to meet me this morning. But look at this instrument, and look at this outfit. They're mine to use today in the ceremony since I'll be playing the role of the goddess. Is that because your dad's the headmaster? Aren't they beautiful? Especially this instrument. They tell me it was just like the one the goddess was said to have in the legends. It sounds gorgeous too. 
I asked father about it and he says it's called a harp. Hello! How you doing? And look at these clothes. I made this wrap myself and we get to use it in today's ceremony. Between the harp and this outfit, I'm going to make a great goddess today. I got you up early this morning because I wanted you to be the first to see me like this, Link. So, how do I look? Uh. <laughs> what should I say? I mean, oh. you can tell her she looks great. What if I was just like... Uh, she might get mad at you. You look great. Uh, nice. Costume. I'll be nice. Ha! I think so too. But it's nice to know you agree. Thanks, Link. Oh, there you are, Zelda. Are you all prepared for today's ceremony? Oh, hello, Father. Oh, uh, Link, you're here too. Outstanding. He has an intense set of eyebrows there. You know what it's like? It's exactly like the owl in um, Link's Awakening. Mm -hmm. I think I think that's gotta be on purpose. Yeah, I think it's deliberate. It's encouraging. He also ne never blinks. It's encouraging to see you up so early, given your capacity for sleep. No doubt today's ceremony had you too excited to close your eyes for once. This music's really good. Oh, he blinked. If you win today's ceremonial race, you'll get to participate in the po participate in the post-race ritual with Zelda, so give it your best up there. Yes, about that. Father, I don't know if I can do it. If he can do it. Wow, hurtful. Recently, Link hasn't been practicing much at all for the ceremony. Called out. Rude. And even when he's out riding his loft wing, he's just lazily gliding around. Probably daydreaming. What the heck, Zelda? Look, it, your ears turned red. What kind of friend are you? And, like, the whole back of his neck. Yeah. Too. I don't know what he's thinking. He's gonna have to be in perfect control of his bird to win today. Mm. I regret saying you look great, Zelda. Yeah, for real. Hurtful. No need to worry yourself, Zelda. Though you may have a point, today's wing ceremony tests the skill of the rider as well as his bond to his bird. Victory will not come easily. And, as you pointed out, I haven't seen him practicing as hard as some of the other students. But you've known him since you were both very little. You should know better than to fret about him. You see, Link and his loft wings share a special connection. I've never seen anything quite like it. I should know, because I am part bird. As you know, each of us in Skyloft is but one half of a pair. We are only made whole by our loft wings, the guardian birds that the goddess bestows upon each of us as a symbol of her divine protection. Can I use some gamer goo? Yeah. Not a sponsor, but they should be. Goo up. <clears throat> when we are young, I'll just go through the conversation. Okay. Uh, Every one of us meets our loft wing under the great statue of the goddess. It's quite a big moment, as I'm sure you recall. Oh, but that first meeting between Link and his loft wing was extraordinary. Because I drive a red Ferrari. <laughs> <laughs> the bird that came to him was a crimson loft wing. It is a breed so rare, we were sure for some time it had vanished from the line. Yes, and the boy and his bird seem to share a profound connection from the moment they met. Like in um, Avatar, the blue Avatar, with the the big, like, banshee. Oh, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. You have to, like, have a connection with it or whatever. Yeah, it's like, because the, the, the human guy gets to... He, Graham always made fun of it, because he's like, he gets all the respect because he drives a red Ferrari. <laughs> And so it's like in this game, it's the same thing. Yeah. He gets the red Ferrari. <laughs> Goo up is a technical term. Do you recall when Link and that loft wing of his first met? What a sight. The little boy just hopped up on that bird and gracefully flew away without even a moment of instruction. They were meant for each other. And judging by how jealous you were that day, I'd say the friendship he shared with his bird didn't go unnoticed by you, my dear. This is a lot of exposition. A lot of exposition. 
but I love this kind of stuff, so. <laughs> That's why you like this game so much. Maybe. It's like an anti Drew game. Uh, but who can blame you? I'm sure you weren't the only one envious of the powerful bond shared by Link and his bird. Anyone who was a part of something special is bound to catch some nasty look sooner or later. <laughs> I think he is supposed to be like the owl. Maybe. I feel bad for being a jerk. Mm -hmm. This contest is nothing to laugh at, Father. This ceremony is part of the final test for those training to become <laughs> knights of Skyloft. If Link doesn't fly fast enough during the race... What? I'll have to be... What if Link messes up his big chance? What if he's not allowed to become a knight? Why is that any of your concern? <laughs> Calm down, my dear. We'll be fine. Honestly, it's almost as if- it's almost as though you become a completely different person when you worry about Link. Well, Dad, in case you haven't noticed, I like him! <laughs> Listen, Link, you better fly your heart out today. At the very least, you need to squeeze in a little practice time before the race. Come on, you'll thank me later. If I- if he has, like, this special bond, then I shouldn't have to practice as much Zelda. <laughs> If I'm naturally gifted. Here we are. Go on now. Jump off the edge. Call your loft wing. It's almost time for the ceremony, so try to practice seriously for once. Hmm? Oh, yeah? You can't sense your bird out there? Oh, I get it. You're trying to weasel out of having to practice. Nice try, but you're not fooling me. Off you go! <laughs> she literally pushed him off the edge. Uh -huh. Okay, Link, go ahead. Just press down and call your loft wing. I didn't even press it. And he never shows up. <laughs> the end. <laughs> Here, Link, jump, 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 do it! How do I press down? <laughs> Maybe you didn't the... read. Oh, sorry. Something's wrong. The end. <laughs> That's probably why you shouldn't push people off cliffs. Hang in there, Link! I've got you! What did Gaypora say? I don't know. Sorry. I was watching chat. I was distracted. <laughs> Are you two alright? I'm sorry, friend. I, I didn't mean to push you so hard. You didn't sprain your wing, did you? This is very odd, Link. What could have possibly happened to your loft wing? For a bird to ignore the call of his master, it's unheard of. Yeah, well, I told her not to push me. And you still can't sense your bird nearby, Link. This is quite a problem, especially considering the wing ceremony is about to start. Cut to Link's loft wing passed, passed out drunk. <laughs> Link, when you said you couldn't sense your loft wing, well, I should have believed you. I'm sorry. I need to tend to my own loft wing, so I'll catch up with you later. You better go on ahead to see if you can find where your bird's gone. My, how did it get to be so late? If I recall correctly, this year instructor Horwell is presiding over the ceremony. Link, you should go explain the situation to him and see if he's willing to delay the race a little so that you can find your bird. Okay. But father, you're the headmaster of the academy. If Link asks Instructor Horwell, he'll probably just come talk to you about it. Ah, uh, quite true. As usual, you make an excellent point, my dear. I forgot I was the headmaster and showing favoritism by training you extra. Very well, I'll explain the situation to him myself. Link, run along, tell Instructor Horwell to come see me in my quarters. May wonder if he's staying in an air B and B. <laughs> that thing looks broke on the ground. Go see if anyone in town knows what happened to your loft wing. First, you gotta tell Horwell. <laughs> Mr. Owlman, is it true what they say about the bird being the word? B -b -b bar bar bird, b -b bar is the word. Can't wait till we get a weapon. No. No 
What's wrong, Link? You're looking a little pale. What? Your loft wing is missing? How strange and troubling. Do you think you can find him? You're going to start looking for him now. How will you make it back in time to fly in the ceremony? It looks like your participation in the ceremony hinges on feather or not. You can find that bird in time. Ahem, <laughs> <laughs> excuse me. I see, so the headmaster summoned me. All right, then I'll go speak with him immediately. I still owe you for helping me out earlier, so don't worry about the ceremony for now. You focus on finding your Loftwing. Wow, okay. Don't men open doors for lady anymore? How long am I supposed to stand here waiting for a little chivalry? Ugh! Literally, that dude is standing right there. Oh, it's you, Link. Say, do you you look all flustered? Did something happen? What? You can't find your loft wing? Um, I don't know what to tell you. I've been here at school the whole time. I'm gonna stand here waiting for someone to open the door for me. All right, we'll see you later. Opens the door and closes it. Yep. A bath. Can I take a bath? You, that looks good there. <laughs> ah, cozy. Can we fill it with water? No. Lame. <laughs> that laugh was painful. <laughs> what laugh was painful? When I was, uh, uh, Instructor Horwell. Oh. About feather or not. It's not. I can't go in her door? I don't know, did you try? Everybody locks their doors here, apparently. Because they don't want people stealing their loft wing, I guess. They don't live in the bedrooms with them. You don't know that. I do. <laughs> no, you don't know that. Okay. Ah. Hmm. So you're telling me I could have just gone this way to talk to What's-His-Face the whole time? No, because it's got to be instructional. <sighs> well? Ah. It's like you still have lots in town to look at. I know, but a gate is not up. Wow, beautiful. Catch it. Can I, why can't I pick that? Mm. <gasps> Hi, Link. Hi. This house belongs to Kukio. Psst, by the way, that's me. I'm gonna go play with my special friend today. It's gonna be so much fun. Sound a little bit like Toad there. Sorry. <laughs> Chest. More than one chest. Hmm. What's that? It looks like a loft wing statue. This seems safe. Waterfall Cave. Beware of blood-sucking monsters. No kids allowed. I am not a child. Let me in! Hello? <laughs> Any blood-sucking monsters? That stole my bird? But I have to go in there. The water is so beautiful. Whoops. Swim time. <laughs> I'm wet. You'll dry off. Drip dry, drip dry. 
all white. What? You are all in the way. Such a beautiful day, but we're too busy to enjoy it. Some things never change. Isn't that the truth? The only thing my lug nut of a son is good for is getting grease on his shirt. All I do is laundry, laundry, laundry. It never ends. I hear you, and I'm terrible at washing clothes. I wish I could get someone to do it for me. Wow. Okay. Thanks for standing in the way. <laughs> juke him out, juke him out, juke him out. Fancy fit. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. You impressed, ma'am? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Link. Hi. Nice race today, She said huh? hiya. I said hiya. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. No, you didn't. Well, it... you didn't enunciate. <laughs> hiya, Link. <laughs> nice race today, huh? Your voice just cracked. Hiya, Link. <laughs> Perfect for the ceremony. So, who do you think will win today? I guess Groose is a strong contender, but the winner will get blessed by a village girl chosen to represent the goddess. How romantic. You're not helpful at all. None of you people are helpful. I want more heart flowers. Can't go in there, I guess. Link. Hey, hey, Link. Oh. Could you help me with something? All you have to do is dash and roll into the tree. Just like I've been doing. Dash, then when you're right in front of the tree, bam! Do a roll right into it. So come on, please. While dashing, press L. This. Press, press it, it in. in? Yeah. Whoa! You did it! A sky stag beetle! Wait up! The world's largest groupie. Oh, my sky stag beetle. I told I should have bought it at air. I wish I hadn't thrown out the one I bought at Beetle's Air Shop. Oh. Why would you throw out something that you paid money for? That makes no sense. If it's not broken. Who are you? Hey, Link. Ooh. Today's the big day, isn't it? You know, the wing ceremony thing? Win this thing, you'll get bumped up to the senior class. Here in Skyloft, it's being able to ride a loft wing that separates the kids from the adults. Mm. And if your goal is to become a knight, well, good technique's even more important. All of us learn to fly the hard way. Lots of practice. Yeah, well, my loft wing is gone. <laughs> People are just not helpful. If you want help, let me know. Okay. I will look up help. I'm good right now. Hey Link, how's it going? The wing ceremony's about to begin, right? Remember when Pippet won the last one right at the last sec won the last one right at the last second? It was so close. Now that was a race. Hey, your Crimson Loftwing will be in the race, right? I'm looking forward to seeing what he can do. Yeah, ha ha ha, me too! <laughs> you know, Groose, that sure was a pain with all that scratching and pecking. Of course it was. You I thought a big, guy. you thought a big crimson loft wing like that was gonna go down without a fight. But we got him, and I don't care how tough those birds are supposed to be. He's not getting out of that pen anytime soon, boys. Whoa, Link. So, uh, yeah, just how long you been standing there? What's your problem anyway? Oh, wait, I got it. You're here to talk about today's race. I can see it in those dopey eyes of yours. They're pleading, oh, Groose, can you please find it in your heart to let me win today? Please. How old is this guy? He's in your class. He's so much bigger than me. He's a large man. He's like 
He's gotta have been like held back multiple times. Like this is like, he's tried to become a knight like 15 times and he just keeps lying about his age to stay in the, the like baby kids class cause he's that terrible. Maybe. I'm thinking that's the- that's He's the, actually like 30. That's the lore. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> And he just, like, bribes the, the headmaster with, like, five dollars and a piece of paper. To be fair, in high school you have kids who look 12 to 24. Yeah, there are some high schoolers that look older than I do now. It's true. You're just desperate to win so you can get some alone time with Zelda up on the stati statue of the goddess at the end of the ceremony. You know, we could do that now. Yeah. I have to. They're basically dating. <laughs> well, sorry, pal. Groose doesn't do charity for wimps. My advice, work hard and wish with all your heart. You might even come in second. It's probably all the smoking. <laughs> Say, come to think of it, how come I don't see your bird? Where is that scruffy pile of red feathers? I can't imagine what could have happened to him. You think his tiny brain got confused by all the clouds and got lost? Nice hair. <laughs> what should I say? I'll say nice hair. Lay off my do right now or I'll flatten you. Everyone knows I got the slickest pompadour in town. Is that what you call that? Cause uh, that's not what that is. Bruce just <laughs> does sickly yellow lipstick. Yeah. It, it might have jaundice. <laughs> <laughs> you know, when y'all getting tired of how you never let anyone forget that you and Zelda go way back. You've been friends since you were kids, big, Deal. It doesn't change the fact that you float through life with your head in the clouds. Would you wake up, straighten up, and grow a backbone already? Dopes like you are dragging our honored academy through the mud. What is that supposed to mean? And just who might you be talking about, Groose? Oh, oh, Zelda, hey. Nah, it's, uh... <laughs> Do that pose. Don't, don't even try it, Groose. You're picking on Link again, aren't you? He's a student at the academy, like all of us. <laughs> Why do you insist on bullying him around so much? I'm trying to get my whole finger. Do in. that face. It's <laughs> good. It's good. It's good. good. I like it. Yeah, I, I suppose. You suppose? <laughs> suppose what? I suppose you... Uh... <laughs> what the heck is wrong with him? So much. Forget it, I wasn't supposing anything, okay? So much. Okay, we're out of here, boys. Later, Link. <laughs> Hope you find your bird or else you're gonna have to sit out today's race. That could be a major setback toward knighthood, so find that bird and get used, real used to the taste of failure. It's your special flavor. I hate to say it, but I'm beginning to suspect that those blockheads had something to do with your Loftwing's disappearance. Yeah, I just overheard them saying that, so... Hope you find your dad. But all I'm go all I'm gonna say is, <laughs> Link, those guys aren't gonna help us find your bird, so we better start searching. Why do you know what I taste like, Groose? I'll fly around Skyloft and see if I can spot any trace of your bird. Father said he talked to Instructor Horwell about delaying the start of the wing ceremony, so don't worry, we'll find your bird in time. I like her little like cape shawl thing. Yeah, she made it. It's cool. Okay, I guess I'll just be here, on my feet. <laughs> Look, that's not helpful. I wouldn't do that. <laughs> yeah, I probably won't go over it. What's that say? What's what's say? That? I don't know. <clears throat> Let sound the goddess's song beneath the light's radiance. Unto her chosen hero shall fall a piercing ray of guidance. Okay, so probably need to do this later. You beat Bug Fables last night. Ah! 
That was close. You lost a heart, though. Oh, um, good thing there's some plants. Congrats on beating Bug Fables. Did you enjoy it? Did you get it on your first attempt? <laughs> wow, this looks great up here. What a view. I think anybody that has stuff over them has, like, new things to say. So, like, that guy on the bench might have something new to say. Oh, okay. What's wrong, Link? What? Your loft wing is missing? That's terrible. I was so looking forward to seeing that red blur streak through the sky. No, no, I haven't seen him. Why don't you look for him by the statue of the goddess? You'll have a good view of the whole town from way up there. The statue of the goddess is the great statue in the north of Skyloft. It's at that place with the X mark. Chest. Chest. And a bird statue? And the whatever that is? The academy? No. What is that arrow? That's where... It's not me. Oh, I don't know. What is that? The plaza. Hmm. Interesting. The bazaar. You know how to read a map, right? Press minus at any time to see a map of the area. I want that. I want that. Oh, first attempt. Nice job. That guy got the gate open. Hey! So I can take a shortcut. Hey! Hey! I don't remember what voice I gave him. Hey, Link! Over here, I have some information about your loft wing. Come over here. <laughs> this... Where this, are you? This camera thing is, is really throwing me off. No, I think he's up that hill. Where? Is he not that no, way? No, I think he's at the Night Academy. That's that. Through that gate. This way. Well, maybe not. The building that you're standing next to is the Night Academy. Yeah, I thought he was over here. Maybe he's down here in the training ring. Yeah, there he is. There he is. He was like, <laughs> "Hey, Link, I was just looking for you. I heard your loft wing's gone missing, so I thought I'd join in the search. And get this: when I asked Fledge what he knew, he started acting weird. I, I I'm so sorry, Link. I really wanted to tell you, but if Bruce found out I told you." It sounds like Groose forced him to keep quiet about it. Go on, tell him the truth. Just a little while ago when I was cleaning the dining hall, Groose and his buddies came in. They didn't notice I was there and started talking about their plan to hide your loft wing. I wanted to warn you, Link, but just as I tried to sneak away, Groose and his gang grabbed me. They said if I told you, they'd make sure I would never be able to ride a bird ever again. Sounds like Groose and his buddies had a plan to capture your bird and hide him near a waterfall. Let's, well, near a waterfall would mean, well, quick, let's look at your map. That's right, right there. I think it means the waterfall marked with an X. Uh, yeah, I already knew that. Forgive me, Link, I can't help being such a coward. I'm really sorry. It's okay, man, you gave me some info, bye. One more thing, Link. If you're going to the waterfall, remember there are dangerous things there. Creepy, crawly things. You'll need to carry a sword. I think I saw the knight commander go into the sparring hall a little while ago. You should go ask him if you can borrow one. Hey, it's Link! So you still want to get in some sword practice even though today is the wing ceremony? I'm impressed. The sword's in the back room. Go on back there and get it. I'll be here for a while, so if there's anything you don't understand about handling a sword, go ahead and ask. Okay. 
He's like the excited gym teacher, like, oh, you wanted to come hang with me? Yeah. Cool! <laughs> I gotta practice song! You got a song! And a song! And some wallet! With no money. I got five, oh, 45 money. I got rupees. Yeah, 45 money. Oh yeah, you wanna learn about how to use a sword? Okay, so the basics of swordsmanship. It's important to think about the direction you're swinging your sword. If you swing it vertically, you'll do a vertical slash. If you swing it sideways, you'll just slash, slash, thrust, blah, 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 thrust, forward to do a thrust. You sound like the <laughs> other guy. Elks yeah. theory over there. Next, there's a more advanced technique, a spin attack. It's a perfect move for when you're surrounded by enemies. If you remember these moves, you can handle yourself in any fight. Just remember the fundamentals. Press ZL to target an enemy as soon as you see it. Try getting in some good practice on those logs. If you forget how to swing your sword, you can always check the help with that button. And once you slice up those logs, I'll set it up so you can try out your big move. Oh my good. I don't think I'm gonna like this at all. So your other option is motion controls. This is horrible. Uh, this is why people didn't like this game. Yeah, because this is terrible. And it's it's delayed, too. Ooh, I don't know. And then you can't move the camera when you're swinging your sword around. Ooh. So if you target... Yeah, yeah for sure, but... If you, and you can do the thrust, but I don't know how to do that one. See, like the logs that have splits in them? They can be cut with the directionally. Oh, so you press R in to press. Maybe you'll be okay with it after some practice. Like Maybe some if I practice. Get used to it, yeah. You really are a strong swordsman. Easy to teach too. You make this instructor proud. Are you ready to try a spin attack? Great. Now I'm gonna surround you with logs. Use a spin attack to cut them all without moving from that spot. Left, right, and left. No. Set them up again. Hey. Good one! That sure looked like it felt good. Why don't you try a fatal blow to close out our session? When your enemy's down, target it with ZL. Throw yourself at it to land a fatal blow. Do a side slash on that log. When it's down, try finishing off with this technique. So it goes up, down, up. That's the way. It's an effective move to use right after you've used your shield or a well-placed spin attack to knock an enemy on its back. But monsters don't stay down for long, so you have to land that fatal blow quick before, you get, before they get up. So I think it's mostly just gonna be practice. Mm. You can also do spin attacks that way too. Gotta juke him with the fancy footwork. I know. Where'd the fancy footwork at? Where am it? Can I not do like a side hop or something? No, I don't know. 
No, I don't think you can kill that log, by the way. No, I know, I know. I'm just... He coming at you! Yeah, the, you can't move very quickly. So, when I was a child and played this game for the first time, it was a lot of... <laughs> in the living room getting yeah. sweaty. <laughs> get used to it yeah I, people have said that it's improved this way it's improved but yeah people did not like the motion controls um that was probably the reason why people hate on the, this game the most yeah i never minded it as a teen but Okay, I think I'll get used to it. Bye! Thank you, Sir. Bye. Hey, Link. You can't take swords out of the side of the sparring hall. What do you think you'd sneak it out with, like, that blood from your head? I don't mind the motion control so much, but they got kind of difficult when I had to swing a specific direction. Yeah. Your loft wing's missing? You wanna go look for it? Well, I guess I can make an exception just this once, but remember that Skyloft is a peaceful place. Only knights carry swords. I don't wanna see you swinging it around like crazy out there. I don't wanna get in a ton of trouble over this, so here's the deal. Make sure you get plenty of practice on those logs. Once you get outside with that sword, you only use it when you absolutely have to. Got it? I think that this would be harder with the one remote. Mm. Because then you're having to move with this and swing. And I feel like that would be kind of difficult. Although it might not be. No, because you literally swing in the direction. Yeah, I know, I know. But that's what I'm saying is like this way you're moving with your this way. Like you're moving oh, and then swinging. Right. So it's, it's, you get to use two hands. Right. And, you know, you can move around, but if you just have one, you're moving like this and yeah. swinging. And yeah. I feel like that could get kind of difficult. It, it does. Yeah. I mean, I'd be willing to try it, but I don't, I don't think I would necessarily want to play it long term that way. See, and now I'm going to keep trying to use the camera and be pulling my sword out. What I'm hoping is that the combat in this game won't be so, won't be as complex because the controls are so. Tricky. I don't remember there being a lot of complex um, fights, but I also blocked out a lot of those fights. And I never beat the game myself. I made it through like two or three dungeons and then that was about it. I want some of my candy, but I don't want to have to get it. I want some more tea. But I don't want to get it. If I get you some tea, I can come back with candy. Okay. I'll just get to the waterfall and then I'll stop. Okay. This guy's looking at that statue. Oh no, it's a little cutscene. Tori's missed it.
just gonna wait on Tori. My strawberries. Yeah, they showed a cutscene. What happened? Link saw his loft wing in distress. I have a wing of skull peels. Mmm. I have strawberries. I have wing of skull peels. Those look good, though. Mm hmm. And put some erythritol on them. Mmm. Let me eat these real quick. Oh no! Oh no. Buried down. And it was a big one too. Mm hmm. There's probably my... dog hairs on the floor. It got on my pants. Oh. <laughs> Storm. <laughs> Not like this. Just rinse it off. I mean, I guess you could do that. I don't trust it. In my house, I would trust it because we don't have pets. But there's probably Montana hair all over the place. So, first impressions of this game? Let's go so far. The controls are going to take me a while to get used to. Mm -hmm. But it's all still better than the DS game controls. What like to use this? Oh, that's the blackberry. Does it have sugar in it? Mm -mm. Okay. I forgot you were drinking. Are you Leon. sure? Yes, I'm sure. Okay. Positive. Yeah. I'm a hundred percent certain. Like doesn't have steep. Like nothing. Nothing. Doesn't have anything in it. Doesn't have anything in it. Okay. Except the blackberry. Ruin, ruin my whole. No, it's three. Days. We haven't put sugar in our tea in a while. That's just the blackberry. Okay. I just forgot you were drinking from the other picture. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, people don't like this one because of motions controls. Motions controls. And other such nonsense. Yay, Keith. I want the money! Oh, more money. Oh! Aww! Missed it. Yeah, I got three musketeers. Ooh, this, this is hard. looking thing in there. Get them choo choo. A jelly blob. I may look like a boring wad of gunk. Not to be confused with chew jelly. It's a jelly blob. These are so ugly. Look at them. Not cute at all. Like, zoo bats are cuter than cute. Zoo bats are kind of cute. 
Two bats are kind of cute. They don't even have eyes. Yeah, I think that's why they're cute. more than just stupid swords! I could shoot them with a bow and arrow or something. Got him! Combo! A monster claw. You tell me a keys has a claw? I enjoyed this one my entire time through, but I do understand people not digging it. I'm getting used to it. It, it really, I think it really is like an adjustment. And to be fair, I think one of the things about Legend of Zelda games that really sets it apart from, like, traditional, like, action RPG, fantasy RPG, is that they really do try innovative things with, um, with the games. So it's more than just your standard, like, Button masher, it's more than just a standard, like, RPG. Oh, crawl, 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 crawl. Face right into the rock. Yep. So, I think that that is what so many people like about Zelda games. Oh, that's all one. There. So, I don't think it's... I don't really think it's fair to complain about... Zelda games being, you know, not like every other standard cookie cutter RPG game because it's not supposed to be. I imagine he just crab walked into that small space. Yeah, he did. Didn't you see him? Help you. Hey Link, I was hoping I'd find you here. I heard you'd gone searching for your bird around the waterfall, so I thought I'd fly around and help you look. How's your search going? Any sign of your loft wing? Oh no, well let's not lose hope yet. There's a place up ahead that Groose and his gang are always hanging around. Maybe we'll find something there. Huh? <laughs> that was like so <laughs> slow. Yeah. Who's that? Who's calling for me? Oh, sorry, Link. I got distracted for a moment. Let's go. She You're coming. coming with me? Yes, yeah, she coming. Okay. Did you see that look he just gave her? He was like... <laughs> he's He has that yeah, expression like... <laughs> constantly. I don't want you here. <laughs> look, there he is. Yeah, that's what we saw. I'm not about it, that's the last we link. <laughs> He's gay old. Gotta be gentle. Cut the ropes. Oh. There he is. Do you like that the Link's loft wing is red? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. He's pretty. It's my favorite color. He's pretty with the purple, white, and yellow, too. Aww, he's so thankful. You saved him. I did. Aren't you proud? <laughs> I adore this shade of crimson. <laughs> we should hurry, Link. Now that your loft wing is free, you should fly to the ceremony. But before you go, I have to ask you something. I I heard this voice a few moments ago. Did you hear it too? No, nope, because you cry cry. It's been happening a lot lately. It's the strangest feeling, almost like someone's calling out to me. Have you ever wondered what's beneath the clouds? Some say it's an empty, barren place, or that there's nothing at all down below, but I just have this feeling that they're wrong. 
Some of Father's old texts talk about a place called the surface. The old tales describe a whole world under there, far more vast than Skyloft. The thing is, no one's ever been down there to see it, and our loft wings won't fly through the cloud barrier. But I can't help imagining the wild things that might be waiting below. Someday I want to see for myself. Here, go find that voice. Link pushes Zelda off the sky island. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh, sorry, Link. We don't have time to talk. Let's get going. Look, your bird's waiting for you. Almost as if someone's calling out to me. Oh, well. Psh. Down to call your bird. Now, time to fly. I like how they give you a little Icarus monitor here. Mm -hmm. Let's run your bird through the basics just to make sure he's not hurt. You can fly your bird in any direction. When it's headed upward, it'll slowly lose speed. When you want to speed up, direct your bird upward to gain altitude, then drop into a fast dive. So again, gain some altitude, then dive to speed up. There, there, the basics. How's handling? Okay. <laughs> motion controls for the camera? Oh, maybe. Maybe that would be easier. Um... So go up. That's the one for... No, no, no. Where it says button only controls invert vertical. Yeah. You can invert it if you want. Oh, I see. Got it. So you just inverted it. Is that there how you want go. it? Yeah. Okay. You play with inverted controls? Mm -hmm. Wow, that's so confusing for my brain. While riding your loft wing, you can press right at any time to go over the basic controls again. You can also charge, which is an attack that gives you a burst of speed as well as slow down when you need to. Oh, sorry, I was trying to fly. Charge is X. So you have three. It's like a dash. So you have three dashes, and then he has to rebuild his um, stamina. Pretty cool to like be chilling on a loft wing. A huge relief. I didn't know. I don't know about you, Link, but your loft wing looks like he's flying great. My father and the others are probably worried about your bird, so let's go give them the good news. Because nobody can see them right there above the sky. Your loft wing really is amazing, especially considering everything the poor guy's been through this morning. I'm gonna fly back and tell father what happened. Well, 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 if it isn't Link. Whoa, Whoa okay. sorry. Word around the plaza is something about being dumb. Well, that's just <laughs> great. Because you and your dumb bird can't tell time. All the practice warm-ups me and the that guys pre -race. did. Pre-race. Pre-race warm-ups me and the guys did were for nothing. Now I'm all stiff. I've been We've been waiting forever for the race to start, and they delay it for you? I don't get it. The big flake gets special treatment. You're almost a man, and yet you still can't seem to go anywhere without Zelda. You can't seem to go anywhere without your weird hairdo. Got him! <laughs> I bet you can't even decide what to have for lunch on your own, huh? You walk around with a posse! How are you one to talk? Sorry. And a Christmas necklace. Probably made in kindergarten. 
still wear it. It's like those paper beads that you used to roll around, like the little I paintbrushes. I don't even know what that is. Okay, never mind. And don't think we haven't noticed the smug looks. Ooh, Zelda and I are best friends. We go everywhere together. Ugh. Do you think you're pretty suave, don't ya? Well, don't ya? Bruce has been going on forever about he's how he's gonna be the one to be with Zelda. He's really got his pompadour and a ruffle about her. <laughs> I hate to break it to you, but today's the day I bust up this adorable little fantasy land you're living in. Zelda's playing the role of the goddess at today's ceremony, and I'm gonna be the one to clean that sailcloth. When I heard she made it herself, man, no way was I gonna let some scrawny clown snatch that prize from me. Oh yes, that sailcloth, Zelda sailcloth, will be mine. <laughs> I can hear you, I'm right here. Oh man, I bet she was thinking about me when she was stitching it. Bruh. <laughs> Yep, I can see it now. First I win the big race and then Zelda and I finish the ceremony together on the statue. Just the two of us. It'll be our special moment alone. Nobody is stopping me and Zelda from having our moment. Oh, it's so real I can... I can see it. <laughs> oh yeah. He has major issues. Gross, it's gross. Behind you. Right behind you! What? Can't you two see I'm in the middle of... Go! Mm -hmm. Care to explain just what you meant by our special moment alone? <laughs> I, uh, nothing big, really. Just, uh, just... Uh, Link! Yeah, I was just telling my buddy here how glad I was he found that red bird of his. Boy, am I looking forward to a fair race. Anyhow, later, Zelda. Look for me during the race. I'll be the one pulling off all the dangerous moves. Hey, Groose, wait up! Did you hear that guy? A fair race? Yeah, the chances of that happening are just about less than zero. Either way, don't let those fools get you down, Link. Just get out there and fly the best you can. I know you got these guys beat, and deep down, I think you do too. Us? <laughs> Come on, Link! Try to focus for once! Because we've never been alone before! <laughs> the wing ceremony Like we just begin. were! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The wing ceremony will just- will now begin. Participating students, please assemble! Looks like it's race time. Good luck, Link. Ready to race? Yep. Wow, look at them! How is that? A thing? I'm sure it's like a. I think it's like a firework, you know, like a smoke bomb. From the. the yeah. They're from the back of the riders. Uh, no, those are turbocharged! Kim trails. <laughs> yeah. Your attention, please. At last, we are ready to begin That's the wing ceremony. Voice. I forgot for a second. I was beginning to worry that we'd have to proceed without Link, but luckily that is no longer a concern. I'm glad you could all make it. Before we start, I'll explain the rules for today's competitions. I have attached a small statuette to this bird, who I will then release to the skies. On my signal, dash from the starting line and dive off the edge. Once you're in the air, mount your loft wing. Remember to call your bird promptly with down once you dive off the edge. Whoever catches the bird... Excuse me. And claims the statuette will be, be this year's champion. Those are the rules. Simple enough, I should think, but do you need to hear them again? Excellent. As you well know, today's champion will graduate to the next class, bringing him one step closer to knighthood. He will also receive a gift from the young woman chosen to play the role of the goddess in this year's ritual. Today's a special day for many reasons, but it is also the 25th anniversary of our fine institution. To celebrate the occasion, today's champion shall also receive his gift high atop the statue of the goddess. I hear the young woman performing the role of the goddess this year has crafted the gift herself. And as you all well know, the role of the goddess this year will be performed by... The lovely Zelda. Let's see your finest flying out there. Show me just how hard you've been practicing. 
Also, I want to see good, clean flying. Anyone caught interfering with other riders will answer to me. Cool. That goes double for you, Groose. Hey. All right, gentlemen, line up. At my command, the competition will begin. His name is Owlan? Like an owl? Yeah, the skinny guy. And the, the king looks like the owl? Mm-hmm. Go! Let's we'll see how we do! How are they all ahead of me? I don't know. Maybe you're just so good. Why are you falling? I don't know. I'm not trying to. I didn't, I didn't make my guy do that. He's trying to dive down on top of him, I can't see. There we go. There we go. Get so far away! I remember this being tricky too. Jeez. Oh, as soon as I get on top of it, it goes the other way. Turns are hard. Yeah. I don't remember if you just have to like wait this out or there we go. Hey, don't you know this is my day to get all oh that's not his voice. Don't you know this is my day to get all the glory? How are they ahead of me? You're so good <laughs> to be having the best logic. <laughs> yeah, you heard him. Let's see how you fly with egg on your face. They're sabotaging you like chumpers. Yep. I see. I just went right into it. Jeez. I suck. No, it's not you. Yeah. You got the bird side to win! A yeah. perfect victory today! Wait till Zelda sees us! Dang, chumps, chumpers, and chumpets. That's right. Drop that harp, that would suck. You've never seen one before in your life. You're just gonna jump off willy nilly. Why did she do that? That seems so dumb. Don't worry, I'm fine. Great flying link, congratulations. Now we better get on with the ceremony. I don't know. I guess time went past. <clears throat> what is on my screen? There's like a scratch. You would catch her. She knows what she's... Oh, so you would catch her. She knows what she's doing. I mean, she pushed Link off an island in the sky. <laughs> she's not the brightest. Link, hand me that bird statuette you grabbed in the race. I must offer it to the goddess. Also, what is around our waist? I've, I, I have yet to figure out our outfit. Maybe it's a sailcloth. Bruce is down there like <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Great 
goddess, guiding light and protector of our people. Grant us your blessing and mercy as I act in your stead during this ceremony. Valiant youth who grasp victory at the celebration of the bird folk in accordance with the other ways. Old ways. Old ways. I now bestow the blessings of the goddess upon you. The blessings of the goddess drift down from the heavens aloft a sail, which I now pass on to you. It smells nice, too. <laughs> I can't make that really slow. It smells nice, too. Style! <laughs> Link, quit goofing. This is supposed to be a sacred ritual, remember? You know, they say that the goddess gave the sailcloth to her chosen hero long ago. Of course, the one you're holding isn't the same one. I've been working hard to finish making that sailcloth in time to give it to today's champion. I'm really glad I got to give it to you, Link. Make sure you take good care of it, okay? Thanks for making it up here to do this with me today like you promised, Link. <laughs> now, we really should finish up this ritual. You... do know what happens at the end, right? Nope! <laughs> <laughs> but with every stitch I was thinking, Goose. Really? Huh. I thought you would have figured it out by now. You have to jump off the statue. Look down. See that big round design on the courtyard below? To finish the ceremony, you need to drop down right into the center of it. Leap off the edge here. Right before you hit the ground, press ZR to open up your sailcloth. Just how brave are you? If you were really fearless, you'd wait until the last second to use your sailcloth. So ready to jump? <laughs> That's the second time she's pushed us off something. Why do you do that? She's a time? terrible girlfriend. What if I just don't pull it out? You get hurt? I guess so. <sighs> do I have to hold it down to use it? I just clicked it once. You were so close to the ground it didn't matter. But you can open it and then when you let go it will put it away. Oh, okay. Yeah. That was perfect! You're amazing, Link! I know. I'm pretty much the best. That's why I'm the main character. <laughs> These birds have really long legs. Mm-hmm. You know, Link, seeing as how you won today, I'm gonna talk for like another hour. And with the weather being so nice, you think maybe you'd like to, you know, go fly around the clouds together? Because we've never done that before. <laughs> today is the first day we have ever flown our loft wings together. Ever! For forget the fact that I just tutorialized you through a flying yeah. through the clouds yeah. moment. Yeah. We just flew through the clouds together, but we've never done this before. Wow, this is nice. <laughs> we just did this. Listen, she's making her move. Clearly. Clearly. Link. Hey, Link. I Those just are really talk large more. words. Link! Hey, Link! Uh, okay, thank you. I want to talk some more. I haven't talked enough. Well, you know, Link doesn't Today talk. Today was amazing. Watching you win the race and performing the ritual together, I'll always remember this. It really was wonderful. Look at his expression. He's like, please stop talking. She's like building up to say goodbye. Link is she missing the moves. She's about to go into the unknown. You know, Link. This is where Frozen 2 There's stole. There's something I've been... <laughs> what? This is where Frozen 2 stole the concept. <laughs> She's gonna go into the unknown oh. and follow that voice that's calling her. The, you know? Yeah. It's literally the plot of Frozen This 2. existed before Frozen. Yep. There's something I've been meaning to talk to you about. See my eyes trembling? 
Oh no! What is that? Into the unknown! Remember that? You didn't do nothing, dumb Zelda! What's going on? move Zelda responds to being pushed off a cliff. <laughs> Link? Did that tornado just falcon punch Link? Yes. Yes. Ah! Ah! <clears throat> lucky, lucky. I am waiting for you. The time has come for you to awaken. You are vital to a mission of great importance. Link? <laughs> oh, you're awake. I was sitting in your room watching you sleep. <laughs> That's not creepy. <laughs> when your laugh wing carried you back, you were limp and unconscious. I feared the worst. Fortunately, you don't appear to have any serious injuries. For that much, we can be grateful. <laughs> but Link, where's Zelda? She was with you, was she not? What's happened to my daughter? Look, he's talking. I know. Confirmation that Link can speak. I'm Edward Culling you so hard right now. <laughs> She's dead. A black tornado, you say? No. It was a brown tornado. True. It was sand colored. We lied already. That was no ordinary storm. not push yourself. You're still recovering. Tell me, when you saw Zelda today, did anything about her seem off? I see. She was talking about the surface then. And you've been having dreams about a great mission? How interesting. I'm sorry, I was lost in thought there for a moment. It's all very strange, but I doubt there's much of a connection between these things. I'm concerned for Zelda, but so long as she's with her loft wing, I'm sure she'll be fine. Either way, Daybreak has yet to arrive. It would be very difficult to spot one girl and her bird in the dark of night. It would also be very dangerous. Rest now, Link. Zelda's going to be fine. She's out there alive, I know it. sleeping with your boots on? Why did they not take his boots off for him? You know, who knows? Zelda's out there alive. I know it. Alright, everybody. Let's get our corpse handling gloves out. He would be a really cool cosplay. A bird? No. I th they I think I ghost! Midna and Wolf Link would be a really cool cosplay. That would be cool. You know how in The Lion King on Broadway the hyena costumes are? Mm -hmm. Like how they have the the things that for the front legs mm -hmm. so it like makes their body like Mm -hmm. Canine looking. Mm -hmm. You just do something like that and do kind of like a. Like a. Well, kind of like a Lion King esque costume for Wolf Link. So you just have like a big head that kind of sits over. Mm -hmm. And then you just do Midna as like a normal sized person could do Midna. And then Wolf Link would be kind of like bigger because it'd be 
and it would be really cool. That's I've thought about that a lot. Yeah, that would I would cool. think that would be really fun. That would be cool. Come here, you! I'm gonna get this thing. Boink. Fall off the edge. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Watch your footing out there in the dock. You never know. There, the, He's got like a spotlight on his head. He's the night watch. I know. In your dock, you never know when you might take a wrong step off a ledge. That's amazing. Don't let me catch you going out flying at night. Only trained knights such as myself should be doing that. You take care now. Yeah, he's the night shift. That's amazing. I had no idea that was a thing. That's funny. Save. We haven't saved in a while. I think this auto saves, but I'm not sure. I don't think it does actually. It says auto save file. Oh, maybe it does. Then. When you sign up, like when you start the game. Oh, this is where I went earlier. Oh yeah, I can use my sail claw. <laughs> kind of didn't help me out there. <laughs> Go away. She runs away. This camera is the hardest thing for me to yeah. get the hang of. Why was the uh, little rat thing evil? Because it's out after dark. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. I thought that was a joke. Nope. I would be so afraid to jump that in real life. Yeah, me too, honestly. Yeah, this, this, uh, the camera angles. This, oh, there we go. Is that better for you? Maybe, I don't know. Oh, it doesn't, when you're targeting, it doesn't work. It's okay, if you missed it, you'd be grabbed by bird lamp guy. <laughs> if you were, uh, if you're in combat, it doesn't, Yeah. you can't move the camera. But if you're still, you can move the camera. Yeah. That's kind of helpful. Hmm, I might like, I might like that, I don't know. You can kind of zoom out. She just pop out of a sword? Mm-hmm. The one chosen by my creator. I have been waiting for you. You will play a 
role in a great destiny. According to your social customs, I should provide you with my personal designation. I never know if it's fee or fi. Hmm. Hmm. That's a good question. Which do you like better? Say it both ways. Fi or fi? No, say it. Read the Fee is the name I was given. Fi is the name I was given. Mm. Or fo or fum. <laughs> I don't know. I think I'm gonna call her Fee. I've heard most people say Fee. But I've also heard Fi. We could just change it every time. <laughs> that won't be confusing. I was created for a single purpose, long before the recorded memory of your people. I must aid you in fulfilling the great destiny that is your burden to carry. Come, Link. You must take up this sword. As the one chosen by my creator, it is your destiny. Let's see if there's a... It is meant to... By Nintendo. It is meant to, according to Nintendo, rhyme with hi. So it should be Fi. Mm. Okay, well, we'll be proper, and we'll call her Fi. Okay. I was gonna look up and see if there's anything, like, bird, some kind of bird-related thing. The strange dreams troubling your sleep. My sudden appearance. Uncertainty surrounding the fate of one you hold dear. Under the circumstances, it is only logical that you would exhibit some apprehension. To minimize your uncertainty, allow me to share some information. My projections indicate that this information has a high probability of altering your current emotional state. The one you seek, Honorable Zelda, is still alive. And this spirit maiden, the one you call Zelda, is another chosen one fated to be a part of the same great mission. Therefore, should you wish to meet with your friend, I highly recommend you take up this sword before you set out to search for her. Does that information invigorate you? Are you ready to accept this sword? It seems that further persuasive measures will not be required. In the name of my creator, draw the sword and raise it skyward. End credits. <laughs> wow, what a great game. Oh, so really the motion, the, the camera, the motion controls with the camera is only this. It only toggles up and down. There's no left. It and doesn't. Right. Well, it does a little bit, but not really. Raise it up. Just spin it back! <laughs> you got the goddess all oh, the mysterious sword is bathed in divine light. Oh, that's just from a hole in the ceiling. <laughs> it's cold, the it's cold in here, that's why I'm wearing tights. Recognition complete. Master. Link. My master. <laughs> Link! I've had my suspicions, but until now I wasn't sure. Yet here we are in the Chamber of the Sword, the very place where it was foretold the youth of legend would one day appear. It is said that this place was left to our people by the goddess herself. The very knowledge of this room's existence is a secret passed down to a select few each generation, along with a handful of words. When the light of the goddess's sword shines bright, the great apocalypse will wake from its long slumber. Do not fear, for it is then that a youth, guided by my hand, shall reveal himself in a place most sacred. 
It started days ago. The sword that I've been, that I've kept secret all these years. It began to give off a faint otherworldly light. At first, I was sure I was seeing things here alone with the sword. There was simply no other explanation. I never dreamed the prophecy of legend would come to pass in my lifetime. The words I have sworn to keep secret are coming true before my very eyes. The youth will be guided by one born of the blade, one who is also youthful in likeness, yet wise with knowledge immeasurable. Ah, uh, yes, the oral tradition, one of the least reliable methods of information retention and transmission. Wow. It appears that critical sections of the passage have been lost over the generations. Just, you know, smack his tradition in the face, why don't you? The youth who draws forth the guiding sword shall be known as the goddess's chosen hero, and it is he who possesses an unbreakable spirit. He shall be burdened with the task of abolishing the shadow of apocalypse from the land. Such is his destiny. With the spirit of the blade at his side, he shall soar over the clouds and plummet below. And united with the spirit maiden shall bring forth a piercing light that resurrects the land. Some of Father's old texts talk about a place called the surface. The old tales describe a new world below, far more vast than Skyloft. Master, you must embark on a great journey beneath the clouds to the vast realm of the surface. It is only through this journey that you can fulfill the mission set before you by my creator, the goddess. It is also the only method available for you to reunite with the spirit maiden, Honorable Zelda. This is no easy task, Link. The world below is a forsaken place, and to reach it you must pierce the cloud barrier below. In living memory, no one has ever done this. Here's a rock. This tablet will illuminate a path through the clouds to the land below. Take it and place it within the altar behind me. Tablet! Weather surface of this heavy stone tablet feels very old! Master, the first thing you must do is hit the crest sitting in this room with a skyward strike. These blasts are formed of pure energy that charges within your braid, blade when you lift it skyward. Once you have charged your blade, face the crest and swing your sword to send out a powerful skyward strike. This is what everybody complained about with the... Yeah, so good up to the crest. I'm actually gonna take these motion controls off. Okay. And then you raise your sword. And... <laughs> Swing! <laughs> skyward, sword, skyward. Close enough! Wise with the knowledge immeasurable? <laughs> we got the wrong guy. like a quarter of a map. Bing. I still haven't been able to try my amiibos! I know. I can't try amiibos yet. Look at this! Look at this! But what's weird is that she has a purple skywing. Sky... Loft wing. No, it's clearly blue. The bad guy flies a purple one. Oh, Groose has a purple one. Just kidding. Master Link, it is done. Until now, a cloud barrier created by the goddess has separated the world you know from the one below. The tablet you placed in the altar has opened a small rift in the barrier. You can use it to travel through the clouds to the realm below. I have recognized you as my master, and so it is my duty to follow you wherever you may go. I reside within your sword and will accompany you in your travels. 
Press down to summon me whenever you require my assistance. Link, listen a moment. The nature of the Great Apocalypse mentioned in the old text is a complete mystery to me. But whatever it turns out to be, it seems that both you and Zelda have big roles to play in the destiny of this land. Just think, if what this Fi says is true, Zelda is alive. Alive and no doubt coming to terms with whatever it is the goddess has in store for her. Should you heed the call of destiny, I don't know what dangers you may have to face, Link. Especially down there. But if you've decided to brave the unknown, please find my daughter and bring her back to me. What we've seen here today defies explanation, but it is the on only the start of your journey. Please, see it through and prove the legends true. No way! You do your people proud, Link. Duty, heh. <laughs> Zelda, Groose, all the same to me. Dawn is drawing near. It has been a long night for the both of us, hasn't it? You have a great journey before you. Link and those clothes, they don't look up to the task. Why does everybody criticize my clothes? Because <laughs> you're wearing a weird thing. What is that red thing? The uniform you were to receive for winning the race should be ready by now. It's like, you know how surfers wear like a rash guard? It's like that, but for my bird. Oh. Okay. I don't know. I just made it. <laughs> okay. A sturdy uniform like that will prove much more suitable for a long journey. You better change before you go. <sighs> Is Link's sword in that amiibo this one? No. Mm -mm. It's the master sword. It's the master sword. That green uniform is what our knights will be wearing this year. To be honest, I had my doubts about the color. But oddly enough, seeing you wear this uniform, I can't imagine a more fitting color for you. It's as though you were born to wear it. Ah, uh, thanks. I watched you change, Link. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hope not. Take care on your journey and be sure to stop by some of the shops at the bazaar here in town to equip yourself properly for the travels ahead. I will return to my quarters and see if I can glean more useful information from the ancient texts. You're always welcome to stop by if you have questions. You and Zelda shall be in my prayers. May the goddess watch over and guide you both. Okay. Uh, you think that's a good place to call it? I want to go to the bazaar. Okay. Go to the bazaar and make some purchases. There's so much talking. Now you know how I feel. That green uniform looks so adventurous. You sure look like a knight now. The headmaster said you're heading out to look for Zelda. Oh, I put a lot of work into making this. You should take it with you. Sorry, I didn't mean to skip his talking. Adventure pouch! It's a pouch for, for you know, adventures. It's an adventure pouch. <laughs> <laughs> it's neat because you can fit four things in it that you'll need for your big journey. You can buy all kinds of stuff in the bazaar that you can put in this pouch. You should go look. <laughs> you should find some potions and a shield. They fit in the pouch and they might come in handy on an adventure. Link, I just know you'll find Zelda for us. <sighs> okay, thanks, weird guy. Fledge. What do you want? Hey, I just saw the news out of all of us. How come you only you got promoted to senior class? Talk about stupid calls. On top of all that, Groose won't come out of his room and Zelda is missing. It's all your fault. Way to go there, buddy. Some senior class guy you are. Look, I'm the one with the cool uniform, not you. I'm clearly special because I have my own room. They're the only ones that share, I think. That they're, guy and the tall one. They're most hated. Ouch. Put that away. Like, 
I'm gonna be pulling my sword out all the time in this game by accident. I just did. Master, I have an update regarding the stone tablet and the resulting column of light it created. The column of light has appeared to the south of our location, and signs indicate that it has created an opening in the cloud barrier to the land below. I must also caution you that descending to the surface armed only with a sword would result in a decreased probability of survival. If you have not already done so, I advise you to purchase a shield and potions at the bazaar in preparation for your journey. Literally where uh, I was going, but that's thanks. That's what I was doing, okay. I'm gonna be pulling out my sword by accident all the time. Likely story, ma'am. <laughs> you could have gone in the door that was open when you came down the hill. What? What are you talking about? Best open door. Oh, I didn't know that was the bazaar. Yeah, yeah. How am I supposed to know that? Because on I the map, it was... it's the big building that says bazaar. Did I, was I looking at my map? No. Ah. Oh, he looks excited. Hello! Um, fancy some stuff? You look like a great customer! Got, like, bomb flowers. He has a shield there. I saw. Hi. I don't know what you have. Ooh! Master Link, this treasure-like tre tre treasure chest-like object is a relic of ancient times left by the goddess for her chosen hero. However, I lack any information on how it can be opened at this time. What? Rip off. Oh, wow, I'm just, you know. What? Those are... I'd imagine it said. Yeah, I guess. So before the column of light appeared, what happened if you tried to break through the cloud barrier? Maybe you just couldn't. What just oh. happened? I don't know. Was that my backpack? That was my backpack. Just fell off the bed. I guess so, but I don't know how. I don't either. A ghost! No. Upgrade. Yeah, so you like bring, can bring him like you know your bow and arrow and your so I can come shield back. and I stuff. I guess I'm. What is this? What oh God, what calamitous visions appear before me? You may not choose to believe me, but my eyes foresee a hazardous thorny road. I foresee okay. what uh, piercing eyes. No harm, guess the okay. I don't want to. Okay, bye. <laughs> Zelda pushed it off. <laughs> Falls breaks every bone on the cement clouds. Burn quite easily. It's an unfortunate property of wood. It could be yours for 50 rupees. <laughs> I've taken the liberty of placing the item in your pouch. So open your pouch. Plus, okay, if you want to equip, you just, you know, you select it and you release R. That's all there is to it. It's there for you. Release. That is counterintuitive. Now it's equipped. Now it's not. Now it, now it is. Why are you standing over there? <laughs> looking at me. Hey, what's up? Oh wait, no, it's not broken. <laughs> yeah, you, sh you shield on me. Fixin? Monster Claw and a Jelly Ball. You have both of those and 30 rupees. And I have that as well. You just won't be able to afford any potions. Oh, no, I don't have a, an Amber Relic. Oh, right, 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 right. Okay. You need two Amber Relics. It's kind of cool. Yeah. Oh. Um, I don't have an Amber Relic, dude. I don't see any point in buying those. I mean, I could buy Bomb Flowers, I guess, but... Fine bomb flowers. Ah, uh, hello, welcome to my world. humble little side business over here. I infuse the potions my wife sells with new ingredients to increase the power. It's nothing really, just something I like to do. Okay, so you can like upgrade potions as well. Yeah. Hey, you there! Yes, you, the adorable boy with the golden hair! Welcome to the potion shop. 
Are you jealous of my nice, strong jaw? Let me tell you, let me look at you and I'll tell you you need some potions. Oh dear, you need some potions, but you don't have a bottle for potions. I'll give you a bottle for potions. <laughs> but here's an empty bottle for potions. <laughs> If your pouch is full, mm. you probably need an empty bottle for potions. Oh. Potions for potion, oh. potion that potions, potions. Yeah, exactly. And it um, revitalizes four hearts, uh, as well as fixing your shield. Your shield. Mm. Hmm. Nope. Don't want no potion? I don't normally buy potions in Zelda games. Can I buy soup? Maybe. Grandma soup? Next, a dash of pepper. Mm. Delicious, a culinary delight. Savor to enjoy. Okay, so I guess not. What is this like? Ah. Item check. Uh oh. Grandma! Okay, well, I guess Chad? I'll buy. Should I buy the shield one? Or the. I think I should just buy this one. Wait, how many hearts? Eight. Deep. We're back. <laughs> of course, brother. I love you so. I hate you so much. How much are these things? Oh, you don't have a bomb bag. Okay. Not surprised. Hmm. Okay. How you feeling? We've been streaming for almost two and a half hours. Pretty good. I was gonna go past where those old ladies were standing. That's over there? Yeah. Across over the that bridge. Yeah. What is she doing? She's petting the air? I have no idea what's happening. Mm -hmm. Hi Link, are you tired? You look beat. I know how you feel. I'm always up for a quick nap. You just make yourself at home. That's you. In a Zelda character. True. Did you watch that clip from my stream yesterday evening? Oh, I haven't. I haven't gone through the clips yet. I'm sure it's a good one though. So that's like where you can rest, like an inn. Uh, hello? All that luck does is make one filthy mess after another. I swear he leaves a grease spot wherever he sits. I know he likes tinkering around with his oily doodads, but I'm drowning in dirty laundry here. It is tough. That greasy lug nuts frame my wires. He's up his unspeakable hours trying to repair that rusty pile of an old robot he inherited. What he intends to do with that scrap he projects is beyond me. Okay. That's the guy who upgrades your weapons. Mm-hmm. This is my cool little spin move I just did there. Yeah, it was pretty awesome. Hmm, interesting. I feel like that's 
probably for later. Well, I think we should go down to the surface and then save it. Okay. What do you think? There's probably going to be lots of cutscenes, but we can do it. Oh, well, we don't have to. We can just save it. That's okay. We can go to the surface if you want. I can save it. I'll forget all the cutscenes, so I probably should wait for the next Do time. you want me to be checking for side quests as we go? I mean, it's up to you. I brought the guide so you could use it. Yeah, but if you- I, am, I only use it to help you, so if you're not interested in side questing- I like side questing. Okay. Well then what I'll probably do is look and see if there's anything we can do in Skyloft before we leave to the surface. Okay. I was gonna- I thought maybe I could go behind the waterfall or whatever, but I keep- I swear. I'm gonna be pulling my sword out all the time. I'm just apologizing in advance to everybody whoosh, whoosh, for whoosh. the annoyingness of it. Are you not gonna go up the thing? Thank you. What's that? A dig spot. I don't have a shovel. Mm -hmm. You sure don't. But I found some money! And a bug! And a bug, which I can't catch. It reminds me of that girl in Twilight Princess who you gotta catch all the bug bugs yeah. for her. I can't swim faster. Nope. Mm -mm. Hmm, apparently Y might do something eventually. He's making a noise out of sure. I thought maybe I could do the uh No, it was behind somebody's house. Oh, this thing. I thought maybe I could. Okay, let me go save it. Okay. And we can call it. So when for the next time, do we? Do you want to start with any side quests available to us here in Skyloft, and then? Yeah, if it's available now. Okay. Sure. So do you want me to hang on to the guide then here, yeah. and I'll look through yeah, it? Yeah, I don't need it because I'm not gonna play this. I feel like her name was Agatha. Oh, the the uh, bug girl. I think it yeah, was. Yeah, I think so. I'm pretty sure it was. We find a bird statue up there, and then to the left. I know a little bit about this game. You know lots more than I do. Do you like it so far? I do. Yeah, I am enjoying it. Good. All right. Hold on, it's saving. Oh, well, let me save and quit. I want to see. I want to see if it does the auto save. If it auto saves. Oh, aren't, oh, I forgot. Remember we t said everybody in Twilight yes, Princess was somebody? Yes, we I did. think you're right, Paige. I think we yep. made you the bug princess. Oh, look, that's nice. It gives you, like, what you're doing. Mm -hmm. What's the next part of your quest is. Yeah. So, look, if we go... See, there, it does autosave. Oh, okay, cool. It just doesn't tell you when it's autosaving, which is a little weird. Mm -hmm. But, yeah. Okay, everybody. I'm starting to get very sleepy. <laughs> it's been a long day. It's been a long day. I had my balance test today, so. All right, everybody, please take care of yourselves. Um, thanks for hanging out with us. I'm very excited to be playing Skyward Sword, and I hope that you had a good time. I did, yeah. I'm and very excited to be playing some Zelda again. It's been a long time. And I think uh, I thank you guys for being here and all of the subs and bits and things she, that were that Paige, were She had a tree in her house. Yeah. That all the bugs lived on. But she did have a lot of books. That's true. Yep. Um, Is that picking up? No. Okay. So, all right. She mostly collected bus bugs. Yeah. Yep. All right, everybody. Please take care of yourselves. Good night. I'll stream at some point. Eventually. This week. Um, so, I know it's hard for me to plan anything. So, just if you can be there, great. And if not, I'll see you next time. But good night, everybody. Take care of yourselves. Bye. Bye-bye.